What's good, Money Squad? Your boy J Money Good is back with another Madden 23 Ultimate Team Coin Making Method video. And in today's video, ladies and gentlemen, we have some very exciting news. It's going to be a lot of coin making opportunities over the next couple of days. Now, Team Diamonds is dropping. Now, I'm going to let you guys know, to be honest, um, I wanted to prepare this year. They kept pushing it back, pushing it back. And I figured that they wouldn't update the overalls. Well, guys, they definitely did update the overalls. Uh, I'm not prepared, but I still have the coin making methods for you guys. Of course, I have the methods for you guys, ladies and gentlemen, or else I would not be me. Do me a favor, guys. Look down, smack the thumbs up, turn your notification on so you can stay up to date with everything that is going on in Madden. The coin making methods today, guys. All right, so one thing, man, uh, they're talking about trophy packs being rewarded. Let's go, bro. I just made major bank from the... Uh, from the uh, strategy item pack. Sorry guys, it's morning time, so I haven't had my coffee. All right, so it's good. Let's get into this, man. All right, we're gonna talk about the coin making methods that you guys can look for today. You can start doing them already. So let's go ahead, we're gonna go to type here, and then we're gonna follow down. We're gonna go to strategy items, ladies and gentlemen. Theme team strategy items. Theme team strategy items. I know, yes, there's a strat pack, but I feel like some of these could go up in price, especially with theme teams being built all right i know a lot of people already have their strat cards but this is one thing you definitely want to be looking into so you can snipe greens through the blue exchange set all right so a lot of people are rolling the strategy back with the gold strats in there i just pulled one just keep that in mind but uh, i definitely feel like that could be a move maybe scooping some of them up all right let's get into sets we don't know what is going to go in two of these sets for the team diamonds okay chances are guys it's gonna be every single gold and every elite from that player if they're 92 overalls guys trust me they're gonna want every low gold every high gold every mid tier uh elite every i even think they might even go all the way up to 88 elites since we don't power cards up this year i feel like they might want to give those cards value man so if you want a card uh what was the team that we wanted we liked i think it was what was it the saints was it the saints so bro one way to prepare man you can just go to saints all right and just sit there and scoop up every saint card you see look boom 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 just scoop them all up dude buy them up buy them up buy them all the way up every card you want guys because guess what tomorrow they're going to shoot up in price they're already up in price if you guys didn't invest i wouldn't pay too much for cards you know what i'm saying i would just basically buy cards to resell back dude yeah last year if you had gold cards right they shot up to like thirty thousand coins man so uh one of our coin making methods dude tomorrow and i know it sounds like funny hey man a pack is not a method dude definitely going ahead and ripping this uh gold pack right here man any pack tomorrow guys is going to be spitting out straight value if you like opening packs tomorrow is going to be your day and this is the pack we're going to be opening on this is what we're going to be concentrating on there's going to be this gold bundle right here man we can rip this pack or we can go game day man we know game day game day is pretty good usually you get some high elites out of here but i feel like dude tomorrow you'll be able to rip these packs and they'll basically pay for themselves look at this we got we get high golds we're getting elites man elites right now are selling for crazy you could probably rip packs today and it'll probably be profitable we got ourselves a dolphin there uh, let's just scroll through the pack real quick see what we get i mean we didn't even get much here man but chances are guys these cards are already up in price but you can see these cards shoot way up look two thousand coins like golds are still down in price man so if you want a specific player for a specific specific team go scoop their gold cards up man go scoop their elites up get every card all right so now let's get more into more of the method side of things guys and this is what i've been doing and i'm going to show you we'll go ahead and do it right now for you okay so in every team diamond set it's going to take high tier elites okay now if you guys look at 84s let's go ahead and let's go back to the auction house real quick all right i know i can go to sets right from the auction house so today what you guys need to be doing now i'm waiting for tonight for 83s to be popping up as well you guys are going to want to snipe 83 team of the week cards tonight when they come out cheap guys trust me you're going to want to snipe them as well as maybe um not really 85s because you don't want to really put 85s in the exchange set if you guys buy 85s what you want to do is you want to hold them for friday if you're buying cheap training for the rolls okay so let's go ahead, man we're going to filter down by newest now and i'm going to show you guys what i'm doing and you guys 
guys can hop on this bandwagon as well. And this has an opportunity to go ahead and make you guys a large amount of coins. Okay, so we're looking for 85s around 10,000 coins. All right, so look at this. Boom, we'll take this one right here. Let's say 85 at 10,000 coins. We'll take that because that's cheap training. Look at that, guys. Look how cheap the training is right now. People are, they don't know what to do. So they're just selling off promo cards like Legends, Most Feared, and they're dropping them down like very, very cheap. Nobody's really buying any anything like that. Look, it's uh, 84 for 13,000. I mean, we could take this and hold this for tomorrow. All right, really, I'm not like investing like that. You know what I'm saying? But if you see a card that's near or close to training value, pick that up today. Pick that up today. So, I mean, like an 85 for 13,000 coins, guys. That's not the worst buy. Oh, was that 84? 84 for 13,000. I mean, that's not the best buy, but that's not the worst buy. All right, here we go, guys. This is the cards we want right here. 84. See that? 84, 8,000 coins. All right, so if you guys stay to the end of the video, man, you're going to get the sauce. The people that bounce, the people that couldn't watch till the end of the video, man, they're not going to get the juice, bro. But if you're here, you're watching, you stayed, man, you guys are getting the joke. You guys are getting the sauce. You guys are getting the juice right here, bro. All right, so we're going to go through. We're going to try and find ourselves cards. Anything that's near training value. Like, this is near training value. You can scoop this. This is a good hold, dude. That's not a bad hold right there, okay? So, scoop anything that is a good hold. That's one thing we want to do, but we're going to get into the method. I'm going to show you guys the method. But we need those 84s that are down around 10,000 coins, okay? 84s that are around 10,000 coins. But anything you guys see... That is at training value. Scoop up, dude. Hold on to it till tomorrow and then sell it, especially gold cards, guys. You're definitely going to want to scoop gold cards up. All right, so we found a couple 84s. Let's just go ahead and go into our method now, okay? So now what we're going to do, man, 84s, guys. You see, and I got that one at 10,000 coins, right? I got that one at 10,000 coins or 8,000 coins. I've been getting them at 10,000 coins, 8,000 coins, 7,000 coins. So, like, it's been costing me anywhere from, like, 24 to say like you know 30,000 coins max all right for 84s okay now like i said we're gonna be getting 83s tonight out of team of the week so we could do the uh 84 85 exchange set now all right so um we don't know exactly what's going in the sets but there should be 86s that go into the team diamond sets and that's going to be like the top card usually now possibly could be 87 88s this year okay that's my guess all right so we don't want to put that shack barrett in here you really you really got to pay attention to what you guys put in sets see i want to take my core elites there guys don't let them do that man you know what i mean pay attention to what you guys are putting in sets all right because it will take your core elites and you don't want that man you want to hang on to your core elites because we know that those that'll go in the sets okay so now we're going to take those cards that we bought at a cheap value right 86 is right now sell for 30,000 coins. Uh, 87 sell around 40,000 coins, okay? Now, tomorrow though, these value on these cards will go up. And we get, we get an 87, which isn't bad. We'll take it. Uh, promo card could go into the set. That's not what we wanted to see, but that's still a W though. Do you understand? That's still a fat W because we just got an 87, right? So we actually won. I think we went in training and we went in coins there, right? All right, so let's go ahead. Let's move on to our next one right here, right? Let's move on to our next one now. Trying to get those core elites. Hoping the core elites pop up. But if we get an 86, guys, it's not an L. So everything you pull out this pack, as long as you pay for it, let's go. Let's go. Darius Leonard, 86. See, guys, we'd love to see that, man, because that could go into the set tomorrow. All right, either that or it could sell high today. So, I mean, if we, sell, if we see it sell high today, we'll take our profit today. If not, guys, we'll just wait until tomorrow to go ahead and do that. All right, so let's go ahead and move on to our next set here, man. Make sure you're not putting core elites in. You don't want to get core, rid of core elites right now. You just want to hold them until tomorrow. All right, you just want to hold them until tomorrow, all right? So, uh, like I said, we want to be doing this way. The 83, and we got another 87, which is a dub. I mean, it's a dub. You know, it's, it's a dub. Uh, not exactly what we want to see, though. Not exactly what we want to see. Still a win, though, right? Because if we pull an 87, that's a 10,000 coin W. You know what I mean? Well, after tax, it's like a 7,000 coin W. But, you know, you guys get you guys get what I'm saying. You guys get what I'm saying. So 87s are a dub. Um, any 86 Corey leads, man, it's a dub. We're just getting 87 after 87 after 87. Now. Uh, I might as well just sell these. I might as well just sell these to get my coins back and then go. And that's what you guys do. In fact... If you guys pull 87s, you guys could just sell them if they're not core elites, right? 
they're not Koi Elites, you guys could just sell them. Now, those cards might go into the set, though. Dude. We don't know. We don't know. Promo cards could go into the set, but I think it's going to be more of Koi Elites. All right. Um, another one, dude. I mean, we're winning. We're winning right now. We just made 714. We just made 21,000 coins. So if we sell off all those cards, the 86 that we keep will be free. So I guess that's a W, right? I guess that's a W, right? Either that or we just like increased our training value. What is this quick sell for? If I were to quick sell all that, I wonder. I gotta I gotta do the math on it. I wonder if we went in training there for an 86. Pretty sure we pretty sure we would for I mean for an 87. Uh let's go ahead, man. Come on, give me a core elite. And we'll take 87s. There we go. Finally a core elite. We get a Devante Adams. Now guys, if this card goes into the Raiders set. You see, you see now? Do you guys see that? Boomskis, right? Boomskis in the motherfucking chat. Can I get a thumbs up? Can I get a thumbs up, baby, right? You guys see what I'm saying? So we paid 24,000 coins for this card, right? Selling for 45,000 coins. 45,000 coins. Right? People are rushing to that Raider set. Not your boy. Not your boy. I'm sniping cheap 84s. Right? I'll sell off my 87 promo cards that I get. Make my coins back. You know what I'm saying? You guys get it now, right? You see it? After I pulled that Adams, it's like, oh shit. Oh, J Money. J Money Good done did it again, right? He's on to something. The dude is on to something again. And there we go. Uh, that's another W. Another 87. We'll take it. So we had what? 186 was it 186 we got out of all those exchanges wasn't it jeez man that's wild oh we're out of cards man we're out of cards man all right we'll use shack barrett dude we'll use shack barrett uh just because i want to get one more exchange here for you guys and then we'll call it a video now like i'm gonna go I'm, actually you know what? i want to show you the other exchange that you guys want to do as well all right uh, we got a Corey lee let's go delvon dre campbell 87 so we hit all 87s on that exchange set except for one right so not only did we win a ton of coins there you see what just happened there guys we just that was all profit that was all profit okay so make sure you're sniping your 84s low now once i drop the video man it could be hard to get 84s so um hopefully i can try and get some uh myself hopefully the 84 market don't get too destroyed but i know it's going to okay but buy them around like 10,000 coins, okay? Now, all right, the other exchange guys is going to be, let's go. Let's go to program here. Let's go to Corey Elite, okay? This is where we're going to eat as well. Um, is going to be the 8485. This is going to be a big set, okay? It takes 82s you want to put in here. So, I mean, if we get 83s cheap tonight, if they are cheap, usually I wouldn't put a high card into a set. But if you see them cheap to where it makes sense, then you can do it, all right? But um, there's really no set in the game that gives us cheap 82s. So, I mean, what I really suggest, man, is uh, sniping those 82s through 85s. Now, if you can get them cheap enough, like 8, 16, 24, right? We know an 84 ain't going for no 24,000. You know what I'm saying? You're probably just better off buying the 84, all right? But if we see the 83s come out cheap enough, to where they're like four thousand coins like four eight twelve all right then it would make sense if you point 85 would make sense all right so it kind of shows you guys what you guys really need to snipe if you're looking so you want to just go ahead and buy all the golds up from the team that you want look at the team diamonds make sure you cop the 82s through 85s because there's not really there's not really an exchange set because 82s are so high in price the value is just not there you're better off just buying the card for the team that you want all right but guys um if the high tier cards like the 87 is 88 go into the set like i think bro it could be a power move see 86 is the one we think go in the set but uh if we're pulling 87s out of the exchange that's fine because that's a w now even the 86 if we pull it usually that wouldn't be a w but today on a day like this it definitely is a w all right definitely is a w let's go ahead and check the price see what these guys are going for we've seen what they sold for all right, so 46,000 coins. So that's not bad. That's a big W right there. That's a big W. Let's see what Campbell's going for. And he's going for 50K. 50K. So, I mean, I basically paid for all the cards that I sniped. I made profit, guys. All right, so uh, what else do I got for you? 
I'm sniping 85s for cheap training right now. Remember, guys, don't forget about legend sets, okay? So last night I made 400,000 coins for doing legend sets. Or I'm not going to point out the specific sets, uh, but I'll let you know. Uh, <coughs> what's it? <coughs> uh, <coughs> Dante Hall. <coughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Uh, very, very, very profitable. Very. <coughs> Thomas Davis Jr. <coughs> very, very profitable sets, guys, all right? So. Uh, you can see, man. We, I think we have what? We still have a couple Thomas Davis sitting around here. Yeah, we got the one B and D. Uh, but yeah, man, definitely, definitely, really good sets. Yesterday we upgraded the team. We got a free Charles Woodson. We bought Dickerson for 200k. We picked up Edron James for 400,000 coins. Edron James is still the best running back in the game. Still the best running back in the game. Compare him to all the running backs. He will maintain his value, or at least he should. Best running back in the game. Uh, Dickerson, I feel like he's still the best power back. Although I might sell him because I do want to get my coin stack up. Also, might get rid of Brucey Bruce here as well. But I did upgrade the team. If you guys want to upgrade the team, today might be the day to do it. Or if you did it yesterday, hey man, kudos to you, man. All right. So make sure you're getting all your solos and shit done. That's all I really have for you guys. All right. We'll have more methods as they come through. But that 84 exchange set's definitely going to be popping. Um, Pick up your golds, man. I mean, you want a team? Go to the team, buy the golds. If you look at last year's Team Diamonds video that I put out, you can go to it. Look at my Team Diamonds. Go to my videos. Go to Team Diamonds. Golds went through the roof, all right? So the get, the gold, get a gold player, the gold pack, or just buying golds, having them in your binder, and sell them tomorrow. They're not up in price like that. They're really not. They're kind of like maintained at the same price. You know what I mean? So here, let's just go. Let's go look. 78s, 79s. Let's just like check out the market. So look, 2,000 coins, bro. I mean, that's that's easy grab. Easy grab, boom, boom. You wanna invest? Just scoop up random cards. Either that or go to the team that you want. Pick up like three, 400K worth. It's not gonna hurt you. It's not gonna hurt you. I mean, worst thing it, worst thing you can do, man, is just exchange them up later on. You know what I'm saying? Look, here's a 79 for the Lions. I don't know what the Lions got. Hey, why not? Why not? I just made a ton of profit off my exchange method, right? So. Uh, that's how I'm going to be doing. I'll probably, I'll probably either rip packs or I might just go to the teams that I want and just scoop up their cards going from low gold, mid gold, and elites. All right? So if you want to prepare, man, it's not really inflated. Uh, the market's actually down from before when everybody else was investing. It's actually still lower because you remember everybody started investing when, like, I think that when the TVP was in store. So now's a good time. And if, I mean, it's not bad. It's, it's not inflated. Everything's still up. You know what I mean? Uh, look, right tackles for the... Is this the Vikings? Yeah, we'll take that, bro. Um, offensive linemen. Offensive linemen gold cards always have very high value, all right, for Team Diamonds. All right, guys, that's all I have for you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed my video. If you have any questions, let me know. If I didn't break something down the way you would like, hit me on Twitter, jmoneygood12. Love you guys. See you in the next one, man. Much love. Get these coins. Peace.